fallout today from a political showdown at the Tennessee State Capitol. The Republican majority voted out two Democratic lawmakers for allegedly violating House rules when they joined protests calling for stricter gun laws. This is the first partisan expulsion in the state's modern history. And ABC's Faith Abubi reports. This morning, the fallout after the Republican supermajority in the Tennessee State House took the extremely rare step of ousting two of their Democratic colleagues. Expelled from the House of Representatives of the 113th Assembly of the State of Tennessee. A third Democrat, Representative Gloria Johnson, narrowly surviving the expulsion. It might have to do with the color of our skin. Johnson, a white woman, joined her two black colleagues, Representatives Justin Pearson and Justin Jones last week in a protest on the House floor, demanding stricter gun laws in the wake of the Nashville Christian Elementary School shooting that killed six people, including three children. The move bringing House business to a halt, triggering the Republican-led expulsion vote on Thursday, accusing the three Democrats of violating chamber decorum. We called for you all to ban assault weapons, and you respond with an assault on democracy. We're going to continue to fight to ensure that more lives are not lost to the epidemic of gun violence. Overnight, President Biden weighing in, writing in part, rather than debating the merits of the issue, these Republican lawmakers have chosen to punish, silence, and expel duly elected representatives of the people of Tennessee. Former President Barack Obama also sharply criticizing the Tennessee Republicans who voted to oust their Democratic colleagues, writing in part, Silencing those who disagree with us is a sign of weakness, not strength, and it won't lead to progress. The Tennessee House Republican Speaker defending the move. There are um, consequences for action. Um, I voted for all three. Obviously, I thought all three should have been expelled. And this is the fourth time since 1866 that Tennessee legislators have been expelled. The two Democrats will get a chance to once again run for their seats once a special election is announced. In Washington, Faith Abube. ABC News.